So if you sit in a way that is comfortable for you to sit, we'll start. Sit up tall and align the back of your skull with sacrum and let your arms rest onto your thighs. Feel the grounding down into your sit bones. And then give yourself a moment, a moment or two, just to feel yourself as you let go, preparing yourself for practice today. In today's practice, bringing the focus down into belly, down into this area that holds many, many different sensations. Feeling the energy that is carried there. And then focusing onto your belly, breathe to belly. Relax your belly and exhale. The end of the exhale, relax your belly and then breathe in. As you breathe, feel as your belly opens up. And as you breathe out, feel the pressing sit bones down. Let your shoulders soften. Relax your belly and then breathe in. As you breathe, feel the opening of the side ribs as your belly opens up. And breathe out, relax your forehead. And then breathe into lower back. And exhale, feel for that release as you let go. Pranayama today is alternate nostril breathing. I'll do that in shoelace pose. So bring your left foot over your right. Then reach your heels out and away from you. Fold the first two fingers down of your right hand and block your right nostril with your thumb, right thumb. Then breathe through your left nostril for five. Block both nostrils, hold the breath, hold for 20. So your feet are active, your spine is long. Exhale through your right nostril, exhale for 10. Breathe through right nostril for five. Block both nostrils and hold the breath. Hold for 20. As you hold, bring the focus back to belly and then feel the different, different sensations that comes up for you. Exhale through left nostril for 10. and release, change the cross of your legs. Fold the first two fingers down of your left hand, use your ring finger to block right nostril, breathe through left nostril for five. Lock both nostrils and hold the breath, hold for 20. Reach your heels away from you and flex your toes back towards your shins. Feel as if you're opening the arc of your feet. Exhale through your right nostril for 10.
Breathe through right nostril for five. Block both nostrils, hold for 20. Exhale through left nostril, exhale for 10. And then release. Unwind your legs and bring the soles of your feet together for into Balakanasana. Then do seat, seated side bend. So bring your left hand by your left hip and then reach your hand about 12, 15 inches away from your hip. Relax your left ear to left shoulder. Pressing down into right sit bone, breathe in, reach your right arm up, spread the fingers. And as you breathe out, reach your arm over your ear. Breathe in, lift belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, you're lengthening your right arm over right ear. As you breathe, lengthen your side ribs away from left hip. And then exhale as you reach in your arm over your ear. As you breathe, lift belly away from pelvis and let lift chest. Feel the moving chest up to chin. And then exhale, you're lengthening your right arm over. On the next breath, breathe in windmill, your right arm down towards the right. Keep lowering the arm away from your ear so you feel the opening through the right side of your neck. And then exhale, relax your jaw. Feel your sit bones and then breathe in lengthen out of lower back. Keeping chest lifted on exhale as you're relaxing your right shoulder away from your ear. Breathe in and expand your ribs. And as you breathe out, lengthen your right arm over your, away from your ear. Use your right arm breathing to pull your body up. Use your left hand to support your head and neck. And then the other side, your right hand reaches away. The hand is about 12, 15 inches away. Relax your right ear to right shoulder. Breathe in, reach your left arm up, spread the fingers. As you exhale, lengthen your left arm over your left ear. Breathe in, lengthen side ribs away from right hip. As you press your left sit bone down, exhale, you'll reach your left arm over left ear. Now breathe as you breathe, lift belly away from pelvis. Exhale, soften both shoulders down. Inhale, expand. So feel your ribs as they open wide to armpits. And exhale, relax your neck. Second arm position, breathe in. Reach your left arm down towards the left side. Keep lengthening that left arm away so feel the opening for the left side of neck. And then exhale, relax jaw. Breathe in, lift belly, lift diaphragm. And exhale, sit bones presses down to floor. As you inhale, expand, expand your ribs wide towards your armpits. And exhale, feel as if you're lengthening your left arm away from you. Use your left arm, breathe in to pull your body up and use your right hand to support your head and your neck as you come all the way up. Bring your hands forward of your shins, hands flat to the floor. Sit bones, presses down, breathe in as you lengthen belly up away from pelvis. And exhale, fold forward, pull belly in. Breathe to lower back as you're lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, fold. That is in as you fold. On your next breath, breathe through sternum, down into belly. 
and exhale, fold. Inhale, release, pushing the floor away, breathe in as you come all the way up. Seated side bend with one leg straight, straighten your left leg. So your right foot is tucked in so that the heel is by the groin. Otherwise, bring your right foot back so that the heel is by your glutes and move your thighs away from each other. Reach your right hand back, grab hold of your ankle or the fingertips to the floor. Inhale, reach your left arm up, open side ribs. As you breathe out, bring your left hand down to inside of left leg. Relax your left ear to left shoulder. Now breathe as you inhale, lift belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, glide your right shoulder away from your ear. On the next breath, slide your right arm all the way around the back. Tuck it onto your left thigh, hip or clothing. And exhale, both shoulders away from your ears. Relax your belly and then breathe down into belly through sternum. And as you breathe out, glide your right hip back, right shoulders away from your ears. Chest opener, breathe in, release your right arm and reach your right arm straight up, spread fingers. As you exhale, as you arc your chest forward, reach your right arm straight back and arm away from your ear. Breathe to the back of your heart, feel for energizing your heart with breath. As you exhale, as you send your right arm back, feel as if you're taking bone away from bone. Arm overhead, breathe in, reach your right arm straight up towards the ceiling. And as you exhale, lengthen your right arm over your right ear. As you inhale, lengthen your lower ribs away from your left hip. And as you exhale, reach your right arm forward, glide your sit bones back. Inhale, feel your ribs as they open wide to armpits, opening lungs. Exhale, fold forward, bring your hands down either side of your left foot. Now inhale, breathe to lower back and lengthen out of lower back. And exhale, fold forward, pull belly in. Keep the neck relaxed and then breathe in, lift belly up, lift it up away from pelvic bone, feel this. Now lead with chest, exhale as you fold. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, fold. Inhale, release and push the floor away. Breathe in as you come up and change. Straighten your right leg. Tuck your left foot in so that the heels by the groin. Otherwise, option of bringing your foot back so the heels by the glute. Reach out, spread the toes. Left hand reaches back, is grabbing hold of the ankle, otherwise fingertips are to the floor. Inhale, reach your right arm up, open right side ribs. Exhale, bring your hand down to the inside of your right foot, relax right ear to right shoulder. If you're not holding your left ankle, lift your left hand up and then reach it back. So you should feel the opening through the left side of your neck. And then breathe, everyone lengthen low ribs away from your right hip. Keep lengthening up. And exhale, glide your left shoulder back and away from your ear. On the next breath, as you breathe in, slide your left arm around the back, tuck it onto your right thigh, hip or clothing. And exhale, keep chest lifted, but glide your left shoulder away from your ear. Relax your right ear to right shoulder and breathe to the left side of neck. Exhale, relax your jaw. Chest opener, release your left arm, breathe in, reach your left arm straight up, spread the fingers. And as you exhale, as you arc chest forward, reach your left arm straight back. Now breathe and breathe to the back of heart, feeling for energizing heart with breath. As you exhale, feel as if you're reaching your left arm back to the back wall. Reach out with the fingertips. 
Arm overhead, breathe in, reach your left arm straight up towards the sky. And exhale, length the left arm forward over your left ear. Press your right sit bone down to floor. Inhale, lift out of right side. To your lengthening side ribs away from right hip. And as you breathe out, send your left arm forward as you glide your right hip back. Deep breath, expand your ribs. So feel your lungs opening up to the side. And as you breathe out, fold forward, hands down either side of your right foot. You can take hold of the foot, the ankle, calf, or hands to the floor. Now breathe in, breathe to lower back as you're lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, fold forward, pull belly in. As you breathe in, lift, lengthen belly away from pelvis. And fold forward on exhale. Deep breath, feel your lungs opening out, so your ribs are opening towards your armpits. Exhale, fold, pull belly in. Inhale, release, pushing the floor away, breathe in as you come all the way up. Wind your legs, coming down for your abdominal sequence, lie down on your backs, doing elbow to knee. Today we do elbow to knee and star spiral pulse. So lie down onto your back, hands are clasped behind your head and neck. Soles of your feet are on the floor, especially if your back is tweaky. Otherwise, lift your feet up off the floor, bend the knees. Your knees are aligned with hips. Heels are just below the knees and the toes are flexed towards your shins. Let's go together, press your lower back to floor. Inhale, lift your head, shoulder blades up, away from the floor. Hold the breath. Exhale, curl tailbone up and reach both elbows to left knee and reach your right leg forward. Reach your right leg forward about 45 degrees angle. Now spread the toes and reach out with the ball of your foot. Pull belly in. Inhale, head to center. Bend the knees, hold the breath, and press your lower back to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Your both elbows are to right knee, and you're reaching your left leg forward. Reach out, spread the toes. Now relax your left hip, curl tailbone up. Send your left thigh away from hip. Pull belly in. Inhale, head to center. Bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up and reach your elbows to your left knee. Reach your right leg forward. Now reach your left elbow up, the shoulder blades away from the floor. Relax your right hip. Send your right thigh away from right hip. Pull belly in. Inhale, head to center. Bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Your elbows are to right knee and reach your left leg forward. Reach your right elbow up, shoulder blades are off the floor. Relax your left hip, curl tailbone up. Lengthen your left thigh away from hip. Pull belly in. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, and press your lower back to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, both elbows to left knee, and reach your right leg forward. Relax your right hip, curl tailbone up, lengthen your right leg away from right hip. Pull lower belly down. Inhale. Head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press the top rib of the sacrum down. Exhale, curl tailbone up, reach your elbows to your right knee and reach your left leg forward. Relax your left hip, curl tailbone up, lengthen your left leg forward, reach your elbows up, shoulder blades away from floor, pull belly in. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up and reach your elbows to your left knee and reach your right leg forward. Relax your right hip, curl tailbone up, send your right leg forward, 
Reach your elbows up. Pull low belly in. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back down to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, your elbows are to right knee and reach your left leg forward. Relax your left hip, curl tailbone up, send your left leg forward, reach your elbows up, pull lower belly in. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back down. Star spiral pulse. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Reach your elbows to left knee. Reach your right leg straight up. Bend your right knee slightly. Now curl tailbone up and then pulse. Reach up with your right heel. Pulse. Keep moving right thigh away from pelvis. Pulse. Now keep reaching your right leg up. Reach up, spread the toes. Lift your head, lift your chest. Reach your elbows up. Pull lower belly in. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, both elbows to your right knee, reach your left leg up. Bend your left knee slightly, curl tailbone up. Now pulse, reach right from your hip, pulse. And then pulse, keep reaching your left heel up, toes flex the shins, lift your head and reach your elbows up. Now pull, belly in. Feel your moving belly away from your left thigh. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, but keep head, shoulder blades up. Exhale, curl tailbone up, elbows to left knee and reach your right leg up. Relax your right hip, curl tailbone up. Now pulse and pulse and pulse. Keep reaching your right heel up, lift your chest, reach your elbows up, pull belly away from your right thigh. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, both elbows to right knee and reach your left leg up. Bend the knees slightly, curl tailbone up. Now pulse, reach up with that left heel, pulse and pulse, keep reaching your left heel up, toes of legs, lift your chest, reach your elbows up, now pull, lower belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, shoulder breath, press your lower back down to the floor. Exhale, release, lower head and shoulders down and place the soles of your feet down to the floor. And give yourself a moment as you feel the pose and feel your belly and notice the energy that is moving there now. Your next pose today is bridge. So draw your heels back towards your sit bones. Um, actually, it's a bridge with the roll. So you need a roll to place between your thighs. Grab hold of the roll, place the roll between your thighs, midway between pelvic bone and your knees. Move your heels back towards your sit bones or heels hip distance apart. Brush your heels with fingertips, then let your arms relax by your side. Shoulders relax away from your ears. Press your lower back down, breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Feet presses to floor, exhale, tilt pelvis, lift pelvis up and away from the floor. Once you're all the way up, gently squeeze the roll. Now breathe in as you inhale, feel. So spreading the ribs, you're spreading your lungs. And exhale, lift up, push the floor away as you lift. Feel the lengthening ankles away from heels. Inhale, lengthen the lower ribs away from waist. Exhale, lift up. Now send thighs and knees forward. As you breathe, get lengthening side ribs away from hips. Feel your ribs as if they're open towards your armpits. And exhale, lift up, push the floor away. Feel the inner sides of your ankles, the insides of your feet as they press and lift. Now breathe and lengthen, keep lengthening out of lower back. 
and exhale, lift up, push the floor away as you lift. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, tilt pelvis, lower your upper back down to the floor. Tilt pelvis, lower mid back down. And tilt as you lower all the way on down towards the floor. Move the roll out of your way. Frog lifting through or straddle lifting through. If you're doing straddle lifting through, you lie down onto your back, your legs are reaching up, you're then straddling the legs out to the side and hands are clasped behind your head and neck. If you're doing frog lifting through, your knees are bent, your heels are aligned with your knees and toes are flexed. You can move to the wall and have your feet up against the wall. So come into the pose today, straddle or frog. Press your lower back to floor, inhale, lift head, shoulder blades up, away from the floor, hold the breath. Exhale, curl tailbone up, now lengthen, lengthen your legs out, reach out, spread the toes, pull belly down. Inhale, lower pelvis, but keep head, shoulder blades up. Reach your elbows up, hold the breath. Exhale, curl elbow up, and then lengthen your legs out towards the side. Reach out, spread the toes, pull lower belly down. Inhale, lower pelvis, lower your head about an inch. Hold the breath. Exhale, curl elbow up. Now send thighs, knees out towards the side, spread the toes, reach out with the balls of your feet, pull lower belly down. Inhale, lower pelvis, this time lift your head, lift your chest, reach your elbows up, feel the side ribs as they open up, hold the breath. Exhale, curl tailbone up, Send thighs, knees out towards the side. Spread the toes, pull lower belly down. Inhale, lower pelvis, lower your head about an inch, hold the breath. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Send thighs, knees out. Keep the chest lifted. Reach your elbows up, feel for opening armpits to sky. Pull. Lower belly in. Inhale, lower your head, lower the shoulders down to floor. Use your hands and draw your legs together. Face your feet to the floor and roll towards your left side. Right hand is to floor by chest, breathe in. On exhale, push the floor away as you come up onto knees. Setting up for dolphin as your next pose. So dolphin pose, bringing your hands onto your biceps to measure and then your elbows to the floor. Reach your hands forward, parallel your forearms, elbows aligned with shoulders. You can clasp your hands in this way. So keep neck and shoulders relaxed and then breathe into upper back, lift, spread back, curl toes on them. Exhale, lift knees off the floor, push floor away as you take the top ribs away from shoulders. Now breathe in as you breathe in, lengthen top ribs away from shoulders. And exhale, reach back, send your sit bones back. On the breath, breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. And exhale, use your forearms as you push the floor away. Keep tucking your elbows in so you're working your serratus muscles, side muscles. Relax your neck, relax your throat, and then breathe through sternum down into belly. And as you breathe out, reach back, heave the floor, send your sit bones back. One more like this, deep breath, spread your ribs wide. And exhale, release, bend the knees, come all the way on down to floor. 
and come up to unto kneeling for Birdwing. Sitting down onto your heels if that works for you, or into kneeling. If you need to pad your knees, then do so. Reach, tuck your elbows into side ribs. Then inhale, draw your hands together. And as you exhale, lift chest and then open your arms out towards the side. Reach your arms back, squeeze shoulder blades. Breathe in, drink, draw your hands together. And as you exhale, opening your arms out towards the side. Breathe in. Be this if you're reaching your forearms forward. And as you exhale, you're opening out to the side. Squeeze shoulder blades. Two more. Breathe in. And then exhale as you open up. Breathe in. And exhale. And release. Come to stand, starting with your salutations. So if you come up to stand, we you do salutations, just do uh, Agnisara in horse stance. So the knees are bent, toes are turned out, knees are to aiming towards your uh, second or third toe. Bring your hands onto hips by your hip crease. Feel as if you're sitting straight down. And take a breath, breathe in. And exhale. And Sarah, tuck the chin in, suck your belly in and up. And let it go. Suck it in. Let it go all the way back. And release all the way back. And release. Breathe in. And exhale. Chin tucks in, suck it in. And let it go all the way back. Let it go. All the way back. Let it go. All the way back. And release. Two rounds fast. Breathe in. And exhale. Move belly as fast as you can. One more. Breathe in. And exhale. And moving belly as fast as you can. And release. Stand up, heel toe, feet together. Stand at the front of your mat. If, you need, if your knees are tweaky, then you might want to pad your knees. Standing at the front of your mat, exhale, hands together by your chest. Feet pressing to the floor, breathe in, reach your arms out and up, lift chest, reach your arms to the sky. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in, hands to the floor. Lunge, breathe in, step your left leg back, bend your left knee, push floor away as you're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Exhale, hands down, step your right leg back for plank. Reach back to heels, bend the knees, Exhale, lower down. Keep the elbows tucked in as you lower down. Inhale, cobra. Draw chest ribs forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press back. Downward facing dog. Pushing floor away in downward dog. Lunge, breathe in. Step your right leg, left leg forward between the hands. Right knees to the floor. As you push the floor away. You're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. And as you exhale, hands down. Step forward, forward bend. Breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, lengthen through the spine as you fold forward. Feet presses down, breathe in, stand up. Lift chest, reach your arms up towards the sky. Exhale, hands together by chest. Chair pose, bend the knees. As you breathe in, sweep your arms up towards the sky, lift chest. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in, hands to the floor. As you breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Flatten your hands to the floor, and as you breathe that step, or hop it back to plank. Lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Inhale, cobra, draw chest forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Warrior one, breathe in, step your left foot forward by left hand. Right foot towards the right edge of the mat. Push floor away, 
as you reach your arms up towards the sky. Exhale, hands down, step your left leg back for plank. Reach back to heels, exhale, lower down, keep elbows tucked in. Cobra, inhale, move chest forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. One in one, breathe in, step your right foot forward by right hand, left foot towards the left edge of the mat. Push the floor away, reach your arms up. And as you breathe out, hands down, step back for plank. You're reaching back to heels and as you breathe out, lower down, bend the knees if you need. Breathe into cobra, move chest forward, lengthen legs back. As you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. On the breath, bend the knees, breathe in, step or hop, your legs between the hands. Keep the neck relaxed, breathe out, fold forward, bellies in. Chair pose, knees are bent, breathe in, lift chest, reach your arms up and reach your sit bones back. As you breathe out, hands together by chest, stand up. Inhale, arms up, telescoping ribs. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in. Lunge, breathe in, step your right leg back, bend your right knee, push the floor away with both feet as you reach your arms up towards the sky. Exhale, hands down, step back with your left leg for plank. Reach back to heels, lower down, keep elbows in. Inhale, cobra, draw chest forward, lengthen legs back. And as you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. Lunge, breathe in, step your left foot forward between the hands, right knees to the floor, push the floor away, you reach your arms up towards the sky. And as you breathe out, hands down, step your right leg forward for forward bend. Breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in. Breathe in, stand up, lift chest, reach your arms up towards the sky. Exhale, hands together by chest. Chair pose, bend the knees. As you breathe in, sweep your arms up, lift your chest, reach your sit bones back. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in, hands to the floor. As you breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. As you breathe out, step or hop it back to plank. Lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Inhale, cobra, move your chest forward, lengthen legs back. And as you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. On the breath, breathe in, step your left foot forward by your left hand, warrior one. Push the floor away as you reach your arms out and up towards the sky. Bend the front knee and feel for pushing floor away with both feet. Exhale, hands down, step back for plank. Reach back to heels, exhale, lower down. Cobra, inhale. Draw chest and ribs forward, lengthen legs back. As you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. Warrior one, breathe in, step your right foot forward by right hand, left foot towards the left edge of the mat. Push floor away as you reach your arms up. Glide your left hip forward, right hip is back. Exhale, hands down, step it back for plank. Reach back to heels, exhale, lower down, keep elbows in. Inhale, cobra. Chest is forward, legs have lengthened back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. On the breath, breathe in, bend the knees, step or hop your legs between the hands. And as you breathe out, fold forward, bellies in. Chair pose, knees are bent, breathe in, lift your chest, reach your arms up, spread the fingers, reach your sit bones back. And as you breathe out, stand hands together by your chest. Press your feet to floor, breathe in and reach your arms up. As you breathe out, fold forward, belly in. Arrow lunge, breathe in, step your left leg back. Release your back foot so the toes are not curled under. Now keep sending that leg back, bring your hands either onto the floor, onto your thigh, move your thigh forward, or if you can, you're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Press down into both feet and as you breathe in, lift up. And as you breathe out, hands down and step back for plank. Reach back to heels and as you breathe out, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra, inhale, draw chest ribs forward, lengthen legs back. As you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. Arrow lunge, breathe in, step your left foot forward between the hands. Release your right foot. Then lift your right knee off the floor, straighten the leg. Bring your hands onto your thigh, traction it forward. And if you can go further, 
you're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Be able for pushing the floor away as you stretch up. And as you breathe out, hands down, step your right leg forward for forward bend. As you breathe, lengthen belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, fold, belly's in. Breathe in, stand up, lift chest, reach your arms to the sky. And as you breathe out, hands together by your chest. Breathe in, arms up, telescoping ribs. As you breathe out, fold forward, belly's in. Arrow lunge, breathe in, step your right leg back. Release your back foot, lift your right knee off the floor, straighten the leg. Either hands to the floor, hands to your thighs, or you're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Exhale, hands down, step back for plank. Reach back to heels, and as you breathe out, lower down. Inhale, cobra, chest forward, legs lengthens back. And as you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. On the breath, breathe in, step your right foot forward between the hands. Arrow lunge, release your back foot, lift your right hand, knee, left knee off the floor, and then hands onto the thighs, you're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Breast up into both feet, breathing, lengthen up. And as you breathe out, hands down, step forward, forward bend. Breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, lengthen through spine. Breathe in, stand up, lift chest as you reach your arms to the sky. And as you breathe out, hands together by your chest. And release. So coming into a B-series free pose vignette. Starting at the front of your mat. Chair pose, bend the knees, breathe in, sweep your arms up, lift your chest, reach your up, sit bones back. Exhale, fold, bellies in, hands to the floor. Breathe in, move chest forward, away from thighs and knees. And as you breathe out, step or hop it back to plank. Reach back to heels, and as you breathe out, lower down. Cobra, inhale. Draw chest forward, lengthen your legs back. As you breathe out, lower down. Hands under the shoulders, press back, downward facing dog. On the breath, breathe in, step your left foot forward between the hands for warrior two. So your arms are reaching out towards the side, bend your front knee. And do the warrior two, clasp your hands behind your back and press both feet to floor. As you press feet to floor, breathe in, feel as if you're pushing the floor away as you lift sternum. And as you exhale, reach your arms down towards the floor, send your thighs away from each other. And then breathe in, push the floor away, lift, chest lifts, belly lifts. And as you exhale, feel as if you're reaching your arms down, keep chest lifted, move your thighs away from each other. One more like this, deep breath, pushing the floor away as you stretch up. And as you exhale, taking it a little deeper. Inhale, release your arms out towards the side. Reverse warrior. As you breathe in, reach your right arm up, open right side. And as you breathe out, reverse, bringing your left arm over your left ear. Press into your uh, right leg, breathe in, lift out of right side. And exhale, reaching your arm over your ear. As you breathe, lift, feel you lifting your belly up away from pelvis. And exhale, lengthening your right, left arm is over your ear. Use your left arm breathing, pull your body up, right hand supports your head and neck. Triangle, straighten your left leg. From here, bring both hands onto, actually bring your Right hand around the back, tuck it onto your thigh. We'll go with traction in your thigh out. So press into your left leg, breathing, lengthen ribs away from left thigh. And as you breathe out, feel for keep moving your thigh away from you. Press into your left leg and breathe, lengthen belly away from thigh. And as you breathe out, glide your right hip back. Press into your right leg and breathe, lengthen belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, keep tractioning your left thigh away from you. On the next breath, release your uh, left arm down towards the inside or outside of your left foot and reach your right arm up towards the sky. Now breathe and glide, press your left foot to floor, glide ribs away from left hip. 
And as you breathe out, as you send your right arm up, glide your right hip back. One more like this, deep breath. And release. Bring your hands down and step back for plank. Reach back to heels. And as you breathe out, lower down, keeping the elbows tucked in. Breathe into cobra. So move your chest down, reach forward as you're lengthening your legs back. And as you breathe out, release, lower down, hands under the shoulders, press back, downward facing dog. Pushing floor away in downward dog. Warrior two, breathe in, step your right foot forward between the hands. The back foot, your left foot is square to the short edge of the mat, line at the front heel, arc of the foot. Clash your hands behind your back. And then press both feet to floor, breathe in, lift belly, dive from chest. And as you exhale, as you push the floor away, you're reaching your arms down towards the floor. As you breathe, lift belly, lift sternum. And then exhale, reaching your arms down. So keep your chest lifted. And then breathe in, lift sternum. Exhale, as you push the floor away, feel as if you're reaching your arms straight down towards the floor. Inhale, release, float your arms out to side. Reverse warrior, as you breathe in, you're reaching your left arm is up, open side ribs. And as you breathe out, reverse it. Your right arm is over your ear. Press in. To left side. And as you breathe out, reaching your right arm over your right ear. On the breath, lift belly away from pelvis. Lift diaphragm, lift chest. And then exhale, sending that right arm over your ear. Use your right arm, breathing to pull your body up, left arm supports you. Straighten your right leg, bring your back foot forward slightly, setting up for triangle, your feet about three feet away from each other. Bring your left arm around the back, tucking it onto your uh, right thigh or hip. Both hands onto right hip. Press into right leg, breathe in, glide ribs away from hip. And as you breathe out, glide your right hip back. As you breathe in, keep lengthening side ribs away from your right thigh. And as you breathe out, keep tractioning your right thigh away from right hip. Now breathe and lift belly, lift sternum. And as you breathe out, gliding your thigh, right thigh away from you. From here, release your right arm down to the inside or outside of your right foot and reach your left arm up to the sky. As you breathe, keep lengthening side ribs away from right hip. And as you breathe out, as you reach your right arm down, reach your left arm up, glide your left hip back. You're pressing into left leg, breathe and lengthen, feel moving belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, feel as if your arms are lengthening in opposite directions. And release. Bring your hands down either side of your right foot, step back for plank. Reach back to heels, and as you breathe out, lower down, keeping the elbows tucked in. Clash your hands behind your back for boat. Keep the neck relaxed. Breathe in, lift your head, lift your chest, lift your legs. And as you breathe out, lengthen your legs back, reach your arms down towards your sit bones. And breathe in, lift and lengthen belly forward away from pelvis. And exhale, lengthen your legs back. One more like this, breathe in and lengthen out of lower back. And release, lower down. Bring your hands under the shoulders. Breathe to lower back, curl toes under. As you breathe out, press it back for downward facing dog. You're pushing floor away in downward dog. On the next breath as you breathe in, warrior two. Uh, breathe in, step your right, left foot forward between the hands and reach your arms out and up. Eagle warrior, breathe in, bring your left arm over the right and bind the hands. And as you exhale, shoulders down. You're pressing down into both feet, breathe to the back of heart. 
And as you breathe out, glide your shoulders back. On the breath, breathe in, breathe to sternum, filling your heart up with breath. As you breathe out, lift your elbows up and reach your forearms forward. Now one more breath here, breathe and spread, spread your ribs out to the side. And as you breathe out, release, float your arms out towards the side. Your next pose today is head, um, Standard warrior variation, placing your left forearm onto your left thigh. Bring your right arm around the back, tuck it onto your thigh hip. And press into your left leg, breathe and lift your ribs away from left hip. And as you exhale, feel as if you're gliding your left thigh forward away from your left hip. Your right foot is anchored to floor. Breathe in and lengthen away from belly. Dive from lift chest to chin. And as you breathe out, slide your right shoulder away from your feet. One more like this, deep breath. And release. Bring your left hand down to the outside of your left foot. And then reach your right arm up towards the sky. Standard warrior. Press down into your left foot, breathing length and ribs away from left hip. And as you reach back towards your right foot, reach your right arm straight up. On the breath, breathe in, lengthen lower ribs away from waist. And as you breathe out, reach your right arm straight forward over your right hip. If you can, bring your left arm forward. So the fact that your tricep, forearm, and arm is pressing against your left thigh, hand is to the floor in front of the foot. Press down into your left foot and left hand, and then breathe in, glide. Arm presses against your foot, and then reach back to your right leg, lengthen. So you're opening the side ribs. And then same again, press down into that left foot, and then breathe in, lengthen side ribs away from your left hip. And as you reach back towards your right leg, lengthen your right arm forward over your ear. Inhale. Release, bring your hands down and step back for plank. Reach back to heels and as you breathe out, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra, inhale, move your chest and ribs forward, lengthen legs back. As you breathe out, press it back for downward facing dog. You're pushing floor away in downward dog. Warrior two, breathe in, step your right foot forward between the hands. Left foot squares to the short edge of the mat. Line up front here with the arc of the back foot, arms reach out to side. Press down into both legs as you're breathing, lengthening up. And exhale, taking it a little deeper. Eagle warrior, breathe in, bring your right arm over left and bind the hands. And as you breathe out, let your shoulders soften down and away from your ears. And breathe deeply into upper back, broaden the back with breath. And as you breathe out, push the floor away, lift your elbows up, elbows high, then heart. Now breathe to sternum, deep breath. Feel the energy, energy down into your belly. And as you breathe out, reach your forearms forward. And release. Float your arms out towards the side. Your next pose is extended warrior variation. Place your right forearm onto your right thigh. Slide your left arm around the back, tucking it onto your thigh by hip crease. Press down into your right leg, breathe in and lengthen side ribs away from right hip. And as you breathe out, glide your left shoulder back and down. Press your left foot to floor, breathe in, lengthen belly forward away from pelvis. And as you exhale, right shoulders away from your ear. Keep lifting out of your right side and deep breath, lift, lift just left side ribs up away from here. And as you breathe out, curl your pubic bone to navel, send your right hip back. One more like this, breathe through sternum, down into heart, down into belly. And as you breathe out, both shoulders down. 
On the next breath, extended warrior, your right arm is down, right hand is down towards the floor by your foot. As you breathe in, reach your right, left arm is up. And as you breathe out, rolling chest open as you reach the fingertips to the sky. Press your left foot to floor and then breathe in, lengthen ribs forward away from hip. And as your right foot presses down, feel for opening your heart, reach up with fingertips. If you can, readjust your right hand. The right hand is just ahead of the foot. Your tricep is pressing against your right shin. Now breathe in, lengthen out of your right side. And as you breathe out, press back to your left foot as you reach your left arm forward over your left ear. Right foot is anchored to floor, breathe in, lengthen. Use the traction of your arm against your, your foot back, against your shin to stretch your ribs forward. And as you breathe out, lengthening your arm forward. Now breathe in, spread the breath across your back. And as you breathe out, lengthen forward and release. Bring your hands down either side of your right foot. Step back for plank. Reach back to heels and as you breathe out, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra, inhale. Draw your chest and ribs forward, lengthen legs back. And as you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. You're pushing floor away in downward dog. Warrior one, breathe in, step your right foot forward, but step your left foot forward by your left hand. Right foot towards the right edge of the mat, push floor away as you reach your arms out and up towards the sky. Archer, bend your left elbow, reach it back. Bring your arm back and bind the hands. Or if you're not making that, use the strap to bind. Press down into your left foot, breathing, lift out of left side. And as you breathe out, reach your left elbow tip towards the sky. As you breathe in, feel for lifting belly, dive from lift chest. And as you breathe out, reaching your left elbow up, softening the shoulders. One more like this, deep breath. Keep feeling for unlocking the shoulders as you reach your left elbow up. And exhale, both shoulders down. Inhale, release. Float your arms up towards the sky. Your next pose is twisting warrior. Press down into your left foot, breathe in, reach your right arm is up. And as you breathe out, bring your arm across over your left thigh. Make a fist, hands into, or hands into prayer. Place your left hand on top. Breathe in, lengthen ribs away from right hip. And as you breathe out, twisting towards the left. Press your left foot to floor and breathe in, lengthen ribs away from left hip. And as you breathe out, as you twist towards the left, glide your left hip back. Your right foot is anchored to floor and then breathe in, keep lengthening ribs away from that left hip. Push the floor away with your left foot as you exhale, twist towards the left. Relax sternum and then breathe through heart. And release. Bring your hands down towards the floor. Place your right knee down. Your right knee's down, coming into lounge lunge. So your right hand reaches forward about 15 inches ahead of the shoulder. Use your left hand to traction your left hand forward. You're straightening your right leg. So breathe in, lengthen through the right side of your body. And as you breathe out, press your left foot to the floor as you're twisting towards the left. And then breathe in deep breath. And as you exhale, keep sending your right leg back, twist towards the left. On the breath, press your left foot down and then lengthen belly forward away from pelvis. Reach your right leg back, opening chest towards the left. One more like this, breathe in and feel your side ribs, right ribs are lengthening away from right hip. Reach your right leg back, press your left foot to floor, twist to left. And release. 
Bring your hands down under the shoulders. Step it back for plank. Reach back to heels and as you breathe out, lower down. Keep the elbows tucked in as you lower down. Cobra, inhale. Move your chest and ribs forward. Lengthen legs back. And as you breathe out, press it back. Downward facing dog. You're pushing floor away in downward dog. Wrap the shoulders if you can. Warrior one, breathe in. Step your right foot forward by right hand, left foot towards the left edge of the mat. Push floor away and reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Press down into both feet and as you breathe in, telescoping ribs up. Exhale, go in a little deeper. Archer, bend your right elbow. Bring your left arm around, bind the hands, or use a strap to bind, or use clothing. You can use your left arm to tuck your right elbow up. Now breathe in, press into your right foot, and then lift out of right side. And as you breathe out, reach your right elbow straight up. Glide your left shoulder down. And then breathe in, feel the strength in legs and then lengthen, feel as if moving belly away from pelvis. Feel your diaphragm lifts. And as you breathe out, send in that right elbow straight up. Left shoulders down. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release, come up. Twisting warrior. So breathe in, your arms up. And as you breathe out, your left elbow is over your right thigh. Make a fist and place your right hand on top. Reach back to your left leg. Breathe in, lengthen ribs away from the left hip. Press your right foot to floor. Breathe out, twist towards the right. And breathe in, press your right foot to floor and lengthen belly away from right thigh. And as you breathe out, reach your left leg back. Relax sternum and then breathe to heart. Feel for energizing heart with breath. And as you breathe out, reach your left leg back, twist to the right. One more like this, deep breath. And release. Bring your hands down to the floor for lounge lunge. Straighten, bring your left hand forward about 12, 15 inches ahead of the shoulder. Reach your left leg back. Right hand tractions your thigh forward. As you breathe in, glide ribs forward away from your left hip. And as you breathe out, press your right foot to floor, arch chest towards your right thigh. And breathe in, lengthen, move belly forward away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, send your left leg back, arch chest towards your right thigh. Breathe to lower back and then lengthen out of lower back. And as you breathe out, keep sending your left leg back, moving sternum towards your right leg. One more like this, deep breath. And release. Your hands are under the shoulders, step back for plank. Reach back to heels, and as you breathe out, lower it down. Keep the elbows tucked in. Your hands are now grabbing hold of your sit bones. Your neck is relaxed. Five breaths, inhale, lift your head, lift your chest, lift your legs. And as you breathe out, lengthen your legs back, spread the toes. Keep the neck relaxed. And then breathe, feel for moving belly forward away from pelvis. And as you exhale, lengthen your legs back, sit bones tucks to heels. Breathe to lower back as you're lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, lengthen your legs back. Relax sternum and breathe through sternum down into heart. And as you breathe out, lengthen your legs back. One more breath in this and release, lower down. Bring your hands under the shoulders. Breathe into lower back, curl toes under. And as you breathe out, press it back, downward facing dog. Pushing floor away in downward dog. 
Bend the elbows, do turbo dog. Squeeze your elbows in. You're wrapping the shoulders. Now breathe to lower back. And as you breathe out, reach your sit bones back. So feel the lengthening through the spine. Your next pose is arrow lunge. Breathe in step, your right foot for your left foot forward between the hands. Face your right knee down, release your back foot and then lift your knee off the floor, straighten that back leg. Bring your hands onto your thigh if you can. And then stay here for a breath and then breathe in. Feel as if you're lengthening away from your right thigh. And as you breathe out, glide your left thigh forward, reach back towards your uh, right foot. If you're going further, you're reaching your arms up. And then deep breath. And as you breathe out, taking it a little deep if you can. Feel the back of your right calf and right uh, uh, thigh as it reaches up to the sky. Breathe in and lift up. Feel for pushing the floor away. And as you breathe out, taking it a little deep. One more like this, deep breath. And release. Place your right knee down. Curl the toes under of your right foot. Lift your right knee off the floor for lunge with your back toes curled under. Push the floor away and reach your arms up or hands onto your thighs. Pressing into both feet as you breathe in, push the floor away as you stretch up. And as you breathe out, go a little deeper, reach back towards your right heel. That right heel is straight up. Now bend your right knee so the knee is hovering just above the floor. And then breathe and lift chest. And exhale, go a little deeper. Left thighs forward. Last one like this, deep breath. Release, bring your hands down and place your knee to the floor. Twisting, lunge, interlock. So your left hand is onto thigh, breathe in, reach your right arm is up. And then you're coming over. Bind the hands under your left thigh if you can, or use a strap to bind. Press into your right shin, breathe to lengthen the ribs away from right hip. And as you breathe out, feel for twisting towards the left. Right foot presses, left foot presses to floor. Breathe and length the ribs away from your left hip. And as you breathe out, glide your shoulders away from each other. Press your right shin to floor and then breathe. You're lengthening out of lower back. Push the floor away with your left foot. On exhale, move both shoulders down. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release. Hands under the shoulders, you're stepping your left leg back for plank. Reach back to your heels, exhale, lower down. Keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra, inhale, draw chest forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Pushing floor away in downward dog. Other side. Arrow lunge. Breathe in, step your right foot forward between the hands. Yeah. That's right. Your left foot is flat to the floor. You release the back foot. That's correct, isn't it? Yes, it is correct. Then lift your knee off the floor, straighten your left leg. If you're going further, bring your hands onto your right thigh, traction in your thigh foot. If you're going further, now stay here for a breath. So press into that right foot and then feel as if lifting belly away from right thigh. And as you breathe that, send your left leg back. Check that there's no sickling in that uh, left leg. If you're going further, you're reaching your arms out and up. And then breathe in, push the floor away with your feet as you stretch up. And as you breathe out, go in a little deeper. And then breathe to sternum. And exhale, go in a little deeper. The back of your uh, left thigh and the back of the calf is reaching straight up. Last one like this. And release. Place your knee down, curl the toes under 
of your left foot. Lift your left knee off the floor. Reach back to left heel. Lunge with your back toes curled under. Hands onto your thigh, traction thighs forward or reaching your arms up towards the sky. Press down into both feet and then breathe in, lengthen up. And as you exhale, taking it a little deeper. If you can, bend your left knee so the knee is hovering. You will feel this into your quadriceps and psoas. So breathe and lift up. And exhale, taking it a little deeper. Reach back towards your left heel. One more like this, breathe in. And exhale, release, hands down. Lounge, lunge. Now I'm twisting, twisting lunge, interlocked, jumped ahead. Is your right foot back slightly. If you're using the strap, then have the strap ready. As you breathe in, your left arm is up. As you breathe that left arm is over. Right arm is around the back, bind the hands, or use a strap to bind. Press into your left shin, breathe in, lengthen ribs away from left hip. And exhale, you're twisting towards the right, good. Now breathe in, lengthen, belly away from left thigh. And as you exhale, as you twist towards the right, glide both shoulders down and away from your ears. Relax chest and breathe to sternum, filling self up with breath. And as you breathe out, move your shoulders down. One more like this, breathe to lower back, lengthen out of lower back. And exhale, release. Bring your hands down, either side of your front foot, step back for plank. Reach back to heels, and as you breathe out, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Bring your hands forward about 10 inches ahead of the shoulder, Low cobra, press the tops of your feet to floor, breathe in, and then move your belly forward away from pelvis. Lengthen low ribs away from sacrum. Keep drawing chest forward. Reach your elbows back to hips. Oh, there you go, the downward dog. <laughs> there you go, exactly the same pose, lower down. Hands under the shoulders, inhale, toes under. Exhale, press it back, downward facing dog. You're pushing floor away in downward dog. Lance Dodger, breathe in, step your left foot forward for warrior one stance. Right foot towards the right edge of the mat. Push floor away, reach your arms up. From here, keep your left arm reaching up. Bring your right arm around the back, tuck it onto hip sacrum. Press down into your left foot and breathe in, lift out of left side. And as you breathe out, feel as if you're reaching your left arm straight up. You can clasp your hands behind your head and neck and then lift your chest as you reach your left elbow straight up. Feel for pressing down into your uh, right foot and as you inhale, lengthen out of lower back. Push the floor away with your left foot as you reach your left elbow up towards the sky. Now breathe and lengthen, keep lengthening out of lower back. Keep the chest lifted, reach your left elbow up to sky. One more, more like this, deep breath. Keep lifting, lengthening, sacrum tucks down, chest lifts, elbow reaches up. And release as you ease all the way on up. Bring your hands down either side of your left foot. Place your right knee to the floor. You might, you might want to pad your right knee in this pose. You'll be on your knee for a, a few breaths. H to B, lunge H to B. So you're reaching your right hand back. You're bending your right knee. You're grabbing hold of the ankle or your foot. Then breathe in, lift belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, drawing your right heel right up towards your glute. And then breathe deeply, keep lengthening out of lower back. And as you exhale, come in as deep as you can. Draw that heel in. Deep breath, lengthen lower ribs away from waist. And exhale, draw your heel in. Now breathe and feel for lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, coming in. One more like this. 
and release. Stay here and then from here, your right hand is down to the floor, just adjacent, just slightly ahead of your left foot. You're reaching your left arm is back, bend your right knee, grab hold of the ankle or your foot. This is uh, lounge, lounge, H to B. So now breathe in and glide your ribs forward on your right side. And as you breathe out, draw your right heel towards the glutes. Keep feeling for sending your right thigh away from you. So breathe in and lengthen ribs forward on your left side as if the ribs are moving away from here. And as you breathe out, draw your right heel in. Two more breaths like this. Your left foot presses down and then lengthen belly, die from chest. And as you breathe out, draw your right heel in. One more like this, breathe in. And release. Bring your hands down, hands under the shoulders, step back for plank. Reach back to heels and as you breathe out, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra, inhale, draw chest ribs forward, lengthen legs back. And as you breathe out, press back, downward facing dog. Push floor away in downward dog. Other side, breathe in, step your right foot forward for warrior one. Push the floor away, you're reaching your arms out and up towards the sky. Lance dodger, keep your right arm reaching up, bring your left arm around the back, tucking it onto thigh, onto hip or sacrum. Press down into your left leg, breathe in, lengthen out of left side. And as you push the floor away, reach your lance straight up. Option to take hold of the back of your head and neck. Press down into right foot and then breathe in, feel your lifting belly, feel your side ribs open up, lift chest. And as you breathe out, reach your right elbow up, use your left forearm to tuck sacrum down. Anchor into your left foot and then lengthen, breathe in, feel you're pushing the floor away with your left foot as you lift up. Now push the floor away with your right foot as your chest lifts, reach your right elbow up to sky. Now feel this right down from belly, move belly, breathe in, move belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, you're reaching your right elbow up, your left forearm tucks, sacrum down. One more like this, breathe in. And release these all the way up. Bring your hands down either side of your right foot, place your left knee to the floor. Setting up for lunge H to B. Pat your left knee if you need. Reach your left hand back, grab hold of the ankle or foot, H to B. Traction your left thigh forward, right thigh forward. And then breathe in, lift belly. And as you exhale, draw your left heel as close towards your glute as you can. Notice the difference between the two sides. Relax your belly. And then breathe in, lift belly. Diaphragm, lift chest. And as you exhale, drawing your right heel, left heel is drawing in. And deep breath, keep lengthening out of low back. And exhale, draw that heel in a little bit more. One more like this. And then release. Bring your left hand down. Lounge H to B. Bring your left hand forward slightly. Bend your left knee. Reach your right hand back. Grab hold of the ankle or the foot. As you breathe, lengthen through the left side of your body. Press your right foot to floor as you draw your left heel towards the glute. And then breathe, keep moving belly forward away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, draw your left heel in. Feel as if you're sending your left thigh away from you. Now breathe to sternum, deep breath. And as you breathe out, send your left thigh back as you draw your heel in. One more like this, breathe in. And release. Bring your hands down. 
Step back for downward facing dog. Feeling for pushing floor away in downward dog. Now as you breathe in, rise up to tiptoes. And as you breathe out, reach your sit bones away from you, then reach heels to floor. Reaching heels to floor, breathe in, feel for moving belly forward away from pelvis. Push the floor away on exhale, reach your heels down. Feel the opening through the back of your thighs, the back of your calves. On the breath, rise up onto tiptoes. Now breathe in, push the floor away with your hands and send your sit bones back, lengthening heels towards the floor. Keep lengthening heels to floor and then breathe, lengthen belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, lengthen heels to floor, the back of your calves, back of your hamstrings are opening up. Then inhale, release, bend the knees and come all the way on down. Grab hold of your roll for cobra push-ups with the roll between your thighs. You're lying down on your belly. The roll is between your thighs. Your hands are under the shoulders. Tops of the feet to the floor. Top tailbones, squeeze the roll. And as you breathe in, move your chest and ribs forward, lengthening your legs back. And as you breathe out, lower down, keep the tailbone tucking. Now top tailbone, squeeze the roll, breathe in and move your chest and ribs forward. Lengthen legs back, tuck your elbows in. And as you breathe out, lower down. Top tailbone, squeeze the roll, breathe in and move your chest and ribs forward. And as you breathe out, Lower down, keep top tailbone, squeeze the roll, breathe in and move your chest and ribs forward. Keep drawing as if you're moving your chest through your arms, elbows reach back to hips. And as you breathe out, lower down. Last one like this, top tailbone, squeeze the roll, breathe in, move chest and ribs forward. And exhale, release, lower down. Move the roll out of your way. Hands under the shoulders, breathe to lower back, curl toes under. And exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Feeling for pushing floor away in downward dog. On the next breath, as you breathe in, bend the knees, step or hop your legs between the hands. Coming down into seated. Grab hold of your uh, strap. Shin bound, shin bound spinal twist. So reach your left foot forward, bring your right foot on top of your left thigh by hip crease. Place the strap around your right ankle and then bring the strap towards your right hip. Bring your left hand around the back, takes hold of the strap by your right hip. Breathe in and reach your right arm up. And as you breathe out, your right hand is coming down to the outside of your left foot. Breathe in and lengthen out of your right side. And as you breathe out, glide your left shoulder away from your ear. Right shoulder is by your right ear. As you breathe, you're lengthening, lifting belly up away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, glide your left shoulder back and down. As you breathe, keep lengthening out of your left side. And as you breathe out, lean back towards your left shoulder. Feel this right down from coccyx and then breathe as you lengthen out of right side. Reach your left foot forward, exhale, lean back towards your left shoulder. Now breathe in and lift belly, lift belly away from pelvis. And exhale, lean back towards your left shoulder. Right shoulder, right arm is reaching forward. 
in her release and change. So your right leg is reaching forward. Your left foot is placed onto your uh, right thigh by your hip. You're using the strap. The strap is around your left ankle. Move the strap towards your left hip. Bring your right hand around the back. Take hold of the strap by your left hip. Breathe in, reach your left arm is up. And as you breathe out, bring the hand down to the outside of your right foot. You might be able to take hold of the foot, ankle calf or the hands to the floor. Press into left sit bones, breathe and lift out of left side. And as you breathe out, glide your right shoulder back and away from your ear. Relax your left ear to left shoulder. Now breathe and lift belly away from pelvis. And as you breathe out, glide your right shoulder back and down. Pressing down into the right sit bone and breathe, lift up. Feel the whole of your right side as it lifts up. And then exhale, lean back towards your left shoulder. Relax your left ear with left shoulder. Now breathe as you inhale, lift out of your left side. Reach your right foot forward and then exhale, lean back towards your right shoulder. Inhale, release and ease all the way up. And then come down into lying down position. Lying down onto your backs. So lying down onto your backs. If you can, bring your hands uh, at the back of your thighs, between your thighs and calves. Clash your hands if you can. Your lower back is lengthening through the floor. So breathe into lower back, spread the ribs to the floor. And as you breathe out, pull your belly in, send your sit bones away from you, draw your knees down towards your uh, shoulders. Keep the lower back to the floor as much as you can. And then breathe into lower back, spread ribs to the floor. And exhale completely, pull belly in. Your belly's all the way in. Feel as if you're drawing your knees towards your shoulders. Feel that compression into belly, keep moving belly away from pelvis. And then relax, last one like this, really feel, breathing deeply, spreading ribs. Now exhale, exhale completely from now, and belly's in. Draw your knees in, feel that compression, send your sit bones away from you. And now stay and feel the energy as it moves around in your belly. And release. Bring these soles of your feet down to the floor. You can stay here with your arms relaxed down by your side or the soles of your feet together. So knees are out towards the side or straighten your legs. If lie down into Shabbasana, if you wanted to move to the wall with your feet up against the wall, that is an option available. For now, just allow your body to relax completely. Bringing your focus back to your belly. And noticing, noticing the energy that is moving through you now. Relax the back of your skull. Feel yourself as if you're sinking, melting down into a really safe space. Your forehead is relaxed, eyes relax. Relax your nose, relax your mouth. Now relax your jaw. It's maybe a good moment to open your mouth, move jaw from side to side, especially if your jaw feels a little bit tight. Helping to release into your masseter muscles, into neck and scalies muscles. Now relax your chin and relax your neck. 
As your body cools down, just relax your shoulders down away from your ears and feel the lengthening into the back of your neck. And breathe into your upper back. And as you exhale, just relax your upper back. Bringing your focus to your mid and lower back and breathe there. And exhale, feel your mid back spreads. Send your sit bones away from you and feel your lower back as it moves closer to the floor. And then relax your pelvis, breathe to pelvis. And breathe out, feel for that release, letting go of the top of your thighs. And as you bring your focus to your thighs, breathe into thighs, your hamstrings, your quadriceps. And exhale, feel for that release as you let go. And bringing your focus to your knees. And breathe to knees. And exhale, feel that release as you let go. Bring your focus to your calves, your shins and ankles. And breathe there. And exhale, relax your calves, shins, ankles. Bringing your focus to feet, breathe there. And exhale. As you bring your focus to your fingers and to your hands and breathe to these areas. And exhale, feel for releasing your hands and fingers. Bring your focus to your wrists and forearms. And breathe there. And exhale, release. Bring your focus to your elbows. Breathe there. and exhale. And bring your focus to your triceps, biceps. Breathe. And exhale. Bringing your focus to your shoulders and collarbones. And breathe there. And breathe out, let your shoulders melt down away from your ears. And bring your focus to your sternum and then breathe there. And exhale, feel for that release. Now bring your focus back to diaphragm and into belly. And then really breathe there. And exhale, relax your belly, relax your diaphragm. Take another breath into belly. And breathe out. Feeling for that release. Allow yourself to be still. Allow your mind to be free. And just check into how you feel right now.
Feel the edges of your toes, the edges of your fingers, the edge of your skin. Breathe to these areas and feel for drawing energy into, into your body. And with your breath, allow that to spread to the, to the exterior of your body. And then feel, bring your attention to your belly. Breathe there. And exhale, release. On your next breath, stretch in a way that feels good to you. And on your next breath, bend your knees, move your knees towards your chest, hug your knees close and allow your body to Move from side to side, forward and back. Either cross your ankles and roll forward and back or roll to your right side. Bring your left hand to the floor by chest, breathe in. Exhale, push the floor away as you come up and use your right hand to support your head and neck. Coming into a seated cross leg position or sit in a way that is comfortable for you to sit. Bring your hands together, the thumbs lightly touch sternum. Give yourself a moment to notice how you feel. A moment to congratulate yourself for your practice today. Thank you for allowing me to guide. Just finishing together with a deep breath. And exhale. Namaste. Thanks everyone. Really well done. You may feel this. So Epsom salt, magnesium, get yourself, um, bring yourself back together as quickly as you can. Uh, Epsom salt, uh, sorry, drink, don't drink Epsom salt, just get yourself hydrated. And I look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care. Bye.